Winston-Salem police are investigating a shooting that involved a car crash and then left a person injured. WXII 12's Louis Tran spoke with a neighbor who heard all of it unfold, and he joins us live on Hawthorne Road tonight. Louis. Hey, Lindsay. Neighbors tell me that the car crash happened in this area near the intersection of Hawthorne Road and Ebert Street. Take a look at the ground right here. You can see scattered pieces of debris across the sidewalk on the side of the road. And to the left of me, you can see a skid mark from last night's crash and broken pieces of plastic like this one in my hand. Now, this was not the only thing left behind from last night's incident. A neighbor tells me that the shooting left a bullet hole in the front side of his home. So I was on my computer and then I heard pow, 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 bang, bang, pow, pow. That's the sound Bird Barnes heard last night at his home. I thought something was exploding in my neighbor's house. On Ebert Street, police say a suspect inside one car began shooting at another driver. Officials say the victim tried to escape and crashed into another vehicle on Hawthorne Road. Shattered pieces of plastic and glass scattered across this sidewalk. Barnes says the two cars crashed right in front of his neighbor's home. Had the, at least four or five bullet holes inside of it. All the windows had been shot out. A bullet also struck Barnes' house. See all this plaster and stuff on the floor and say, I don't remember this. And then you look up and you see a hole in your wall. Now Barnes says everyone in the Twin City must look out for one another. If you see something, say something. Now police say that the victim had a non-life threatening gunshot wound. The second driver of the second vehicle involved in the crash had minor injuries. Police did not share details on any suspects. In Winston-Salem, I'm Louis Tran, WXII 12 News.